assalamu alaikum friends uh, in this uh, session we shall cover uh, the reporting aspects in the series and distribution module some of the common reports some of the important reports uh, frequently used reports so the first one we are discussing is uh, a report of the siege orders so va05 is the t code so you can locate it in the easy access menu and there are so many parameters uh, which can be given so i run the report without any parameter and I get the report of all the sales orders present in my system. So we can see here is a customer reference. This is actually sort of a purchase order number which the customer comes up with. And this is the date of the document, which means the date of the sales order. Uh, and <clears throat> this is actually, uh, say, this code of, the code of the customer, right? So it is a customer code. Uh, customer number uh, this is the material uh, within the sale order so since every material is shown in a line item it means one sale order can be repeated over here so for example uh, if you see sale order number five and number four so it are they are being shown two times just because they have two two items in the same sale order and then we have the quantity of the material being ordered by the customer and then the total amount and we can work out the price as well so that's it this is a very very comp uh, very rich report in terms of the operations also which are available on this report so first of them uh, is that we can just drill down so for example if i want to see this particular customer order i just double click it and the system will take me to this particular order so you can see now that uh, this is uh, the customer uh, um, the sold to party and the ship to party you would have studied the business partner partner functions in the uh, sale and distribution uh, in the last video uh, and uh, uh, and this is the total value net value and here is some header details and this is the um, plant from which the delivery is to be made and this is uh, actually the item so there are two quantities of uh, dxtr uh, uh, and touring bike and uh, there are some other details as well and the price agreed was three thousand so the total amount is six thousand so we already know uh, that we can we can see the document flow uh, that what is the status of this particular sale order so we can see that it has been invoiced it has been delivered everything is complete go back to the report so another functionality is that we can we can customize this report in terms of all these things so for example if i want to uh, I, if i want to sort this report onto the customer code i just select this column and sort in ascending order so the entire report is now sorted on the customer number and this uh, red pointer pointing upwards means it is being sorted in an ascending order if i want to sort it in the descending order so i will just do this so it will sort it in the descending order similarly uh, this sort functionality can be done on any of the fields then we have some filter functionality for example so if i want to see the orders in the report only for customer number 21000 uh, then i would use this filter uh, selecting the column first so the system automatically uh, filters for the particular column and i say the sold to party number is 21000 so now you would see that uh, uh, this report has been shortened now because it is showing only data of one customer so if i want to come back to the complete report so delete the filter so this is the complete report again and there are some other functionalities we can we can uh, have a print preview we can uh, uh, we can export it to a local file we can email it from the uh, sap email interface and more importantly we can change the layout as well so it means these are actually the displayed columns and these are the all available columns so if, if i want this report to be say more precise more concise then i i maybe uh, remove some of the fields from here so for example i just need the document date i don't need the document type I need the sales document, document item, sold to party, material, order quantity, and net value. So if these are the only things I, uh, I want, I can just transfer them, and now this report is relatively a concise report. Again, I can export it to a local file as well. So uh, again, uh, we can we can save some of the formats, and just we change them, and uh, some other functionalities as well. So this is. Uh, uh, how uh, this report can be used and now let's let's make sense of some of the parameters so for example if i am interested 
in a series uh, of a document if i have the document number say document number one to document number 100 then the, i will uh, just be uh, one to 50 so then then the say uh, report will only contain these 50 documents so in the scroll bar you can see so the sales document number sale order number is now one to 50 only not beyond so this was use of one criteria we can make use of other criteria as well so for example uh, we can filter on run this report on order type on a particular customer on a particular document date on a particular material and uh, uh, when actually this order was created and uh, created by on a user as well and uh, there are some other uh, organization data uh, also available so for which sales organization for which uh, uh, division and for which distribution channel so a few assignments for a few activities for you people uh, within uh, our client which is a gpa client please look for uh, the sales orders uh, which are and let me do one for you so i am doing it for the sales organization ue00 which is us east so let's try to run it so these are the sales order for the us east and uh, okay so we can come down and we can see the entire report here so uh, we cannot see exactly the count of uh, the nine items in this particular report uh, probably it might have been hidden somewhere uh, in this uh, more but uh, uh, i'm not sure about this so anyway so uh, let's uh, now uh, a few activities for you people please uh, see uh, the report execute the report and tell me how many uh, how many sales order exist uh, if it is a shorter report you can count them for material uh, deluxe touring bike 1000 to material deluxe touring bike 1100 so the requirement is material should be dxtr 100 to dxtr 1100 so this is the first requirement uh, then come back and save your report to some local file on an html format then come back and see how many sales order have been created by user id teach dash triple zero t e a c h dash triple zero which is my user id by the way and then again go to the report save the report on a local file so that you can submit it uh, if uh, and when it is required as an assignment then third run the same report again for the users uh, from l e a r n dash 101 to LEARN-300. So I want the sales orders, all the sales orders created by LEARN101 to LEARN300. Remember the format of the user ID is LERN- which is which is the minus sign and three numbers. So run this report, save this report again uh, on an HTML format and come back to. Remember whenever you come back to run the report again, you should make sure that uh, the old criteria, old filters have been removed so that the new filter is actually effective because if multiple filter will simultaneously affect, it will it will affect the overall report. Uh, then uh, try to run the report for the division bikes. So if you, if you use this uh, F4 on the division, so we can have this division bikes. So run this report for the division bikes. Uh, again, uh, we need to enter first now I think there are more options now yes right so because this ue00 was a system duty so run it for the division bike again save the report on some some HTML format and then uh, run the report for the open sales order only no other criteria just the open sales orders and then save this report on HTML format let me run this large report for you again so let's see how many sales orders are open so almost there are many sales orders which are open right which it means either the delivery is not had, has not been made or the invoice has not been completed so we go back this was the sales order report in the next videos we shall see some other reports thank you